Honestly, y'all, I might as well just call myself Hall Channel at this point. Yeah, this happened. <sighs> Torrid knows the way to my heart, and that's Hope Cash. So, we earned Hope Cash with my last haul. And so it came time to redeem said Hope Cash. So this happened. Let's just get into it. So y'all know what time of year it is. It's fall, which means it's sweaters, which means Alyssa was like a kid in a candy shop because I'm a sweater whore. Let's just put that out there. So this first sweater that I got is so freaking cute. This is just a basic knit, but it's got this adorable lace up on the sides of like the collarbone, leading from like the armpit to the collarbone type of thing. This is beautiful gray. It's so freaking soft. And it does have the banded bottom, which I prefer. It's a little longer, which is good. So I got this in a zero. <sighs> This sweater is so freaking cute. I'm so excited. This is going to be perfect with a pair of boots and a pair of jeans. I'm going to roll around looking all cute. So the next item that I got was... I can unfold it like a normal person. So it's just a basic ribbed knit long sleeve type of top. It's got a whole lot of stretch to it. I got it in a zero. And, but the one thing that kind of drew me in about it was that along the sleeves, it's got this tie up detail. It's not functional, which I prefer, but it just gives the shirt a little bit of zhuzh and a little bit of necessary, hey, look at me type of thing. So it's in this beautiful maroon color. I don't think I saw it in any other colors, but I could be wrong. Um, it's got just a round crew neck type of neck. Um, it's very soft. It's got a whole lot of stretch to it, like a whole lot of stretch. But this is going to be so comfy to throw on underneath my leather jacket with some jeans and some booties, and it'll be whole. It'll be a whole look. So the next thing I got was just one of their plain t-shirts. I never do this. I never get their t-shirts because they're so freaking pricey. Like who decided that a t-shirt could be $35? Who decided that? Because I want, I want to have a word with them. I want to speak to them about this predicament that they put us in. So I got this in a zero. Y'all know it's like my color of the year. This beautiful olive green says la lune le soleil i think it's the the, the lunar what's it the, the lunar eclipse or, i don't know it's got like a sun and a moon happening over there it's it's soft it's my color it's got something kind of cute on it that happened so i got this in a zero and i just wanted something that was going to be nice and comfy and I love their t-shirts even when they are stupidly overpriced. So the next product is another sweater. This might be my favorite thing. I don't know. It, it would be a hard toss up to pick one of my favorites but this is definitely up there. This is a black basic sweater but the shoulder is cut out and it's distressed, like all over the place. So we've got distressing up here. We've got distressing along the back. We've got distressing on the torso area, like distressing everywhere. It's black, it's long sleeve. It's a little sassy with the cold, cold shoulder. And I just think this is gonna be perfect. And it's a nice sweater material, but it's like, lightweight so it's gonna be good for here because we get winter but not like winter winter like it gets down to like the 60s 
during the day. So it doesn't really get that cold, but this is going to be perfect for it. I'm so freaking excited to wear this. It's going to look cute with literally everything. Like I'm going to throw this on over to leggings and look like a hot ass. Okay. So the next piece, oh, I love these so much. I almost didn't get them, which I'm like flabbergasted about. Um, they're a pair of jeans and they're black. And they're high-waisted, so they just have Alyssa's name all over them. I'm so freaking excited about these jeans. Oh my god. I hate how expensive Torch jeans are. I really do. It drives me crazy. These retail for $65. So painful. Literally the most expensive jeans I've ever put on my body. But they're just so good. They just know what they're doing when it comes to jeans. Actually, when it comes to anything. So I got these in a size 10. As you can see, it's got the three button closure. It hits me right at my belly button. So like the perfect high waist part of my body. Um, I got them in a 10 regular. I, was, I almost didn't get these because they're a different style than I normally buy from them. I normally just get their premium stretch denim. But these are the, these are the jegging fit. And I've never tried the jegging fit on. And I was just not in the mood to go into a dressing room and try on jeans. Like, you, you know, when you get in those days where you just, you're not in the mood for it. Yeah, I was in one of those moods. So I took a chance and I knew that I was a 10 in the regular premium stretch denim. So I just said, screw it. I'll get them. And I'll try them. If not, I'll just have to bring them back. But I'm so freaking excited that I did because I'm obsessed with these. They are the perfect tightness at the ankle. I hate. One of my biggest things with skinny jeans is once you get up to my size, most retailers assume that you're proportionate. And I'm not. <laughs> I got a big butt and I got wide hips. But my ankles are really tiny, so I need retailers to understand that there are big butt girls who have tiny calves and tiny ankles, and Torrid gets it. They just do. <laughs> so this is the perfect ankle for me. It fits perfectly. They're not too long. They, oh, they're perfect, and I'm going to get so much wear out of them, so they had better last for... $65, they better last like 10 years. Let's be honest here. This next product, you guessed it, is another sweater. I'm so excited that it's sweater time again. Like, oh, I'm just so excited. Okay. Okay. So this is a thick, chunky knit sweater and it's black, but it's like stonewashed black. It's got a cutout here that leads down into tie-ups over the first half of the sleeve. Oh, I'm so freaking excited for this sweater. It's so soft and squishy and just comfortable. I, this is my favorite time of year. Can you tell? Like, and it has strings right here so you can loosen and tighten the tie-ups as you prefer which i think is really good because not everyone has the same type of arm um it's got banded sleeves which i really like and it's just it's so soft and comfy i'm crazy excited for all of these sweaters like i don't know what to do anymore i need to go through my sweaters and get rid of some old ones because, yeah, I bought a lot. Okay, two products left. So, I don't know about y'all, but I love a good t-shirt. Like, I live in t-shirts. And nothing makes a t-shirt better than a sassy, sassy saying on the front. So, I got this t-shirt. And it's in this beautiful blushy mauve type of color. I love it. I got it in a double zero. 
this point. Friday is my second favorite F word. <laughs> like, this is me in a t-shirt. I love sassy t-shirts. I love sassy sayings. And this is just like everything to me. <laughs> this was the first thing. Like, I walked into the store and just beeline straight for it. I was like, yes. <laughs> and actually, me and my sister both got one because... Honestly, this just uh, describes me and her and my mom to a T. Like, <laughs> it's perfect. Oh, I love this t-shirt so much. And it's, again, stretchy as all get out. Uh, let's see. I said I got it in a double zero. And it retails for $35. Like all of their other overpriced t-shirts. I see you, Tort. I see what you're doing. And it's rude. I don't like it. <laughs> So, the last item, I, I had to, I had to get another one, I had to get another one of these colors, like, how can I not have, like, a million things in this color, right? Right? It, it's not too much, is it? Okay, so, this is a long sleeve rib knit, actually not even rib knit, this is, well, I guess, long sleeve knitted t-shirt in the army green. It's got buttons down the front, not all the way down, just like down the chest. And then it's got patches all over the place, which I think are super cute. I just give it a little bit of a different vibe and it really amps up the military aspect. And this is, I have a jacket that matches this perfectly. Like I'm pretty sure it has this exact patch on it. So I just think that's adorable. Um, I got this in a zero. Yeah, I, I go back and forth between the zero and the double zero, and I wasn't sure with this one, but like I said, I was not trying it on. So I went with the double zero, or the, I went with the zero, because I thought that the double zero would be a little hard for me to button and keep buttoned over my chest, and I wanted to be able to control how much cleavage was happening, and I figured with the zero, I can wear a tank top underneath and control even more. So this is like... It's very thin. I'm definitely going to need a tank top because, like, you can see me through here. I can I can see you. So, um, but it's lightweight and it's going to be perfect under a leather jacket. And I'm just, I'm so excited because it's, like, it's my color, you know? You know? Oh, it's so pretty. Okay, so that is everything in this fall toward haul. I hope you guys liked it. I know. I, I do so many hauls. It's ridiculous. But if people would stop coming out with cute stuff, I would stop buying it. That's just, that's the way it works. So I hope you guys liked this video. Please subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll catch you in my next one.